tsunami warning. So I guess that big planet in the freaking sky that they spend billions of dollars hiding with their uh, sun simulator and uh, projector and everything else. So that's pretty bad. You know? So this is one hour ago. The last time that we had a tsunami or warning, my mom was still alive, and I said, I'm going to go check out the tsunami on the, uh, at the beach. She freaked. And I go, listen, I got a broken leg. I can still hobble away if it's bigger than I thought it was going to be, you know. But honestly, I think it won't go past my toe. And I was right. So, that planet X. I'm going to call it Planet X because uh, I'm 100% sure I don't know exactly what it is. And Planet X is, a, X is a great variable for a planet that you don't know that you see in the sky through the weather cameras. And now they've changed it into a triangle. But you know that they put something in there, you know, to make the triangle. So it must be the projector that is projecting the triangle because I've seen the sun go on the other, the sun simulator it would be a sun simulator go past and hide the triangle. So the only reason why that it can hide the triangle is because the triangle is behind the sun simulator. And you can look in the FAA cameras. What do you see? Black dot. Oh, that's a sun simulator. There's no black dot in the middle of the sun. They spent billions, maybe even trillions of dollars hiding this. I discovered it in 2018. But it looks bigger now. It wasn't so big in 2018. It's closer. And, and that would affect our magnetic field. So we're having earthquakes, tsunamis, volcanoes, and weather problems. They're lying to you. These uh, fuckers in charge, they all built super fucking bunkers. So that they can actually escape. But I know what's going to happen. They'll probably get covered in the bunker and can't get out. Apparently. You know? Because if the world's going to shake and rattle and roll, how are you going to get out of your bunker? What if a mountain falls on it? You're trapped in your bunker. But anyway, that's their problem, not mine. I don't, I'm not even concerned about their health. I don't give a fuck about their health. I'm just so pissed off. So, anyway. I wish I knew what time the tsunami was coming so that me and Daisy could go check it out. Yeah, shut up, BC information. Don't you ever fucking beat my fucking phone again when it's turned off and there's no fucking uh, uh, Wi-Fi, no mobile data on. Yeah, I was pretty pissed off. Yeah, why don't you tell about the, plan the planet up there in the sky, hey? Because uh, you know what? Nobody would believe you're a fucking fluke.